When we first learned about Kelly and her breast cancer, it was just a fluke. We were sitting on a beach together, and her sister mentioned to her that she thought she had a, a strange-looking freckle. And at the time, we actually laughed about it. And she said, no, really, Colleen asked Kelly to have it looked at. And within a week, she did, and it was cancer. At that time, it was really shocking to all of us because we had heard about older women having breast cancer and women over 50 and maybe 60, but this was our 37-year-old amazing niece who had her whole life ahead of her and two little daughters, and it, it just came so close to home for us. Within months, Kelly had to have a mastectomy. After having all of her treatments a year later, it was diagnosed that she had to have the second breast removed. And we are hopeful that this November she may possibly have breast reconstruction surgery. It was a little thing that most people would probably not even think twice about. And we're really fortunate that Kelly did catch it in time and she's still here in our lives. It's hard to not talk to somebody that you know, a friend, a family member, that isn't touched by breast cancer. In our family, uh, we've had a long list of breast cancer survivors, fortunately. Uh, both my grandmothers had breast cancer. My mother had breast cancer. We have two nieces that have been battling breast cancer, uh, close friends of our family. And uh, it's, it's something that's, that has to be cured. Because of that, we have to keep working towards finding the answers that will cure cancer once and for all. We just hope that we can, our small part uh, helps make a contribution in our lifetime, we're able to see that cure. This October, for every story shared, every new Facebook fan, and every pizza sold, Hungry Howie's will make a donation to the National Breast Cancer Foundation. Join us. Together, we can make a difference.